Good afternoon, guys. It's kind of a rainy day today, but I want to show you how to simulate the experience of looking at a Marth Rocco painting. Um, you could all do this at home. It's not that hard. What I've got here with me is a couple sheets of construction paper, um, a towel, and a sweater. Random for experiencing art. But I think it'll give us the idea of what Mark Rothko was going for. Mark Rothko wanted the viewer to be immersed in color. And he wanted you to stand in front of a painting that was so large that it took up your entire view. Everything around you, you were in that painting. And the paintings were mostly just solid color. So what I'm going to show you to do is that you can take just a sheet of paper. Maybe this yellow sheet of paper that I have here. I'm not sure if it's going to come up yellow. Can you see yellow? Yeah, it's yellow. Oh, that's green. <laughs> Yellow's on that side. Okay. Um, and if you hold the paper in front of your face and just relax and let most of your view be nothing but that color and you'll get a sense of what Mark Rothko was looking for in the, in the viewer. He wanted the viewer to really just embrace the quiet simplicity of a color. And I encourage you to let your eyes kind of wander while looking at the color and let your eyes just kind of relax into that color. And after a minute or two, you will get a feeling of what that color feels like to you and how it affects your view. So that's what I'm encouraging to do to really feel what a Marth Rocco painting would be like. Another way that you could do this, you could try a variety of colors. I could hold, I only have one hand right now. I'm waiting for a tripod. You could hold a sweater in front of your face and get the same effect. Or maybe if you wanted to try multiple colors, possibly a towel simulating the Mark, Marth Roccos that would have one or two colors in them. I encourage you to not use anything like an artwork or something that would have a variety of colors, nothing with images. Um, try and limit it to stripes of one or two colors or solid colors. Um, anything will work for this. You could use a sheet, you could use a piece of paper, you could use a towel. Um, a t-shirt will work, you know, not a t-shirt that has images on it as well, uh, you know, but a solid color t-shirt. I want you to really feel what it's like to step inside of that color and to understand what Mark Rocco wanted you to feel when you stood in front of his paintings. This is just a simulation. Obviously, you're not looking at the Marth Rocco painting and how his brush strokes would have actually moved your eyes around a little bit more than just a solid color itself, but I think it's a good experience of how it feels to stand inside of color. So make sure when you're done with this, you look at the Google Doc and you record your experiences with different colors and different materials. And um, hope you guys are having a decent time and keeping up with things and I'll continue to put out video lessons and keep in touch with you guys. All right, thanks a lot and uh, talk to you later, bye-bye.